So with, with you know with an ACL rehab, it's it's about the, the contact and the curves and the turns. But good to see Jordan Morris getting back. Robert Sabiga blows the whistle and it is off and running. I, I know what Pat Schmetzer is doing and I recognize the pinch and I think he's right to do it. No disrespect. And there's still great players available to come off the bench. Here's Acosta. Acosta with a try that's rising from outside the box. Oh, he blasted it. Turning and driving forward, Jesus Ferreira. Atencio really got caught out here. A lot of space for Ferreira to come forward. Jesus will uncork a shot that's saved by Richie. You know, you know, Will Bruin's been a soldier in Major League Soccer for a long time, but you know, it's a big upgrade there to have Rui Diaz over Bruin. And this is just the fourth game of the year for Ladero, who immediately finds Rui Diaz, whose shot is blocked, and then his follow-up after the ball blocked, and he scores immediately into the game. And the 14th goal of the season has been scored by Rui Diaz to give Seattle the lead. To right there, nobody closing down. Rui Diaz coming off the defender. Tafari got the first block in. Got a little unlucky there. Set ball bounces right back to Rui Diaz, and he certainly knows what to do with it. Ends up catching a little bit of the woodwork on the goal. Steered it off the crossbar and the post both. Which. Makes it pretty much unstoppable if you're Jimmy Mauer when you put it off two posts like that. Wow. Raul Rui Diaz joins Seattle. Relatively speaking. Vargas on the left. Vargas still going. Vargas cuts it back right into the path of Aura, and somehow he doesn't finish it. Second assist this year. And the ball does bounce a little bit. Villarreal was when Armando Villarreal gave 10 minutes of added time the other night. Well, he just gave, or Robert Sabiga just gave five minutes of added time tonight, and those five minutes and the game are now over.